Hi, welcome to Ivy Lane Interiors. This is Lisa, and today's project is this Thomasville dresser. And it is one I offered up on my local Facebook marketplace as a customization. So I had a client reach out and they wanted it to be restained a darker color. So I decided to go ahead and strip the whole thing down and we're gonna restain it. So I'm using Clean Strip Premium Stripper. I'm just going to apply it, let it set, and then I'm gonna come back with my putty knife and I'm just gonna remove that finish. So stripping's not hard, it's just laborious. So it takes a lot of time. Um, there's a lot of moldings on this one. And if you see the, the grain of the pattern, it, it went vertical, not horizontal. So that's always a little bit more difficult because you, you really, you want to, you know, go with the grain. And so that just makes it really hard because it's vertical. There's just not a lot of depth there. So that made this piece a little bit more difficult to strip because there's just not a lot of room to get your um, sandpaper in there. So it just took a little bit more time. Once I had the stripper all taken off, then I went through and sanded through the grits. So I'm going to start with 80. I'm going to go up to 120, 180, and I'm just going to do that on every single inch of this entire dresser, all of the drawers, the base, the top, the sides, the frame, the whole thing has to be completely sanded through all of the grits to be ready for stain.
Well, after all that staining is done, we're ready to actually go ahead and restain. So I'm going to start with a pre-stain conditioner by Minwax. And this just helps the stain go on a little bit smoother, prepares the wood, makes sure that it's ready for stain so it goes on less blotchy. I'm using General Finishes Gel Stain in Nutmeg. So after the pre-stain dried, then I'm just giving it a little scuff sand and then I was going right on to my gel stain. All the hardware was original brass, and so I just soaked it in some boiled water and vinegar, and then I'm going to come back with some Barkeeper's Friend. I'm just going to polish everything up. So pretty. I love when I can use the original hardware. After the stain, I'm going to go ahead and top coat it with a high-performance top coat by General Finishes. And now I'm ready to go ahead and line my drawers and attach my hardware. I like to pull my liner across um, and then I just make a little cut. Then I'm gonna take it to my cutter and I'm gonna make a clean cut. Then I'm gonna trim off any extra. So I'm going to take it and put it against the inside of the box area, and I'm just going to trim off a little bit of that. The secret to drawer liners is you just don't want a lot of extra paper. Just makes it a lot more difficult to get into the uh, corners and to trim it when you have too much paper you're working with. I usually take off about a third of the liner here. I just took off the whole thing because it's a smaller drawer, and then I'm gonna line it up along the back. And I'm going to start pressing it down with my hands and I'm just going to start smoothing it out. Then I'll come in with a Bondo spreader and I will just make sure that there's no air bubbles and just really get it into all of the corners. And then next I'll use a wallpaper scraper, which is a little bit stronger plastic. And then I'll really get into those corners and get it ready so that I can use my X-Acto knife and trim up any excess paper. So let's look back at the before. My pictures aren't very good. It did need some work. Looks good at first glance, but after a full refinish, here is the final product. What do you think? Can I tell you a secret? I don't like the color. I think it needed to be darker, but nutmeg is beautiful, but I just feel like a, like a darker walnut or maybe a mix of walnut and nutmeg would have looked better, but it's a lot of work. I mean, it's beautiful, um, beautiful wood. I was able to retain all of that wood. It's, it was in fabulous condition. I just, I think it needed to be a little darker, but what do you think? Would you have gone darker? Did you like the nutmeg? You could be honest. Tell me. Thanks for watching. Tell me what you think.